Ladies and gentlemen, Greg McCloskey with the Forex Quick Look at the Sterling versus U.S. Dollar. As we head for the uh, near close, the uh, the uh, pound versus U.S. Dollar is heading to new session lows. The low price just reached 1.2097. Uh, that's the uh, lowest level uh, going back to uh, go back to the daily chart uh, this uh, day day right here, uh, which is March 16th, 2023. And staying on this daily chart, uh, the price is also getting closer to the 38.2% retracement of the move up from the September 2022 low to the July 2023 high. 38.2% retracement comes in at 1.20763. That's the price right here. That's the line right here. Uh, I'm getting down to a price of 97. That gets within 21 pips of that 38.2% retracement. Uh, whenever you have a trend-like move like we did in the pound versus U.S. dollar all through here uh, for you know nearly a year uh, to have a corrective move to the downside and not get below the 38.2% retracement is sort of a slap in the face of the sellers uh, on this uh, move down. In other words, uh, you have to get below the 38.2 of a trend type move to, to prove that you really mean business. Otherwise, these guys over here are still more in control from a longer term perspective. Yes, the shorter term perspective is to the downside. And one may argue that being below the 100-day uh, moving average, that's a blue line in the char chart, and the 200-day moving average, that's a green line in the chart, uh, is more bearish on the longer term. But you're, you're bearish through here. And then you have to prove yourself again here. And so traders need to get below that 38.2% retracement. If they can't get below that retracement level, then I would expect a rotation back to the upside. And we'll be looking toward this swing area between 121.87 and 122.27 on the top side as the next target to get through. If we get above that, then we could see further short covering in this uh, pair as traders uh, think that, well, maybe the, the uh, corrective move is over and we're heading more into an upward uh, move that might get us back above the 200 and 100 day moving average. So that's my story, my technical story for the Sterling versus US dollars. We close, head toward the close of the New York day and head into the new trading day tomorrow, October 3rd. My name is Greg McCloskey. Good fortune with your trading. Bye-bye now.